Look who it is. Hello, hello. Uh, Sierra joining me now because we are official members of the Surprise Squad. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> today for the very first, this is so good. Th is. Like, this is so, so good. I, I, you're, you're lucky to be watching right now. Uh, <laughs> you're lucky to be watching any day, really. Uh, today, for the very first time, the WABI Surprise Squad made good on our promise. That's right. Many of you saw the ads featuring us and our partners in, these, in this venture, Renewal by Anderson, asking for nominations for a teacher, coach, or staff member who goes above and beyond in their job. So, we had so many entries, and in the end, it's difficult, but you can only have one winner this time out. Yeah. So we settled on one. And the surprise squad made our way to Glenburn this morning. Here's a look at how it all went down. Hi, everybody. We are about to go live at our school that we're about to surprise. But Very exciting. Say, look at this. Look at this collection. Squad. Do you guys think your school is awesome? This is John Small, our 6 o'clock anchor and news director. So you may be wondering why we're here, right? Yeah. Okay. I suppose at some point we have to tell them, right? But, but, but before we do, hang on. What does is, what is Miss Thayer do that's so great? She like, instead of making stuff like boring, she makes it like fun in every way. Always makes us laugh during like a math or reading. She always has us do fun stuff, we do math activities. A huge relief to know that they realize that I really do what I do for them and that I love what I do and I try to do everything for the kids and make them happy. and make them love school. Have fun, but keep working hard no matter what. Don't give up. One, two, three! Oh, man. Uh, you can't even, re I mean, that does a really good job, but running into that gym, oh, it was electric. It really was. I yeah. mean, I was not expecting that amount of energy, but I'm so happy that it was met and 
it, it was just such an amazing moment, and, and it was so lovely to talk with the principal as well. Yeah. You know, he said, we're just so fortunate to have somebody like Heidi here. Yeah, I, also, I think uh, the school, they were so happy to have us there. We yeah. were so happy to be there. I think John and Kim, look out the, the guys who do the Let's Get Ready to Rumble. They got yeah. them all riled they up, so they excited. could have a job as uh, promoters, uh, <laughs> <laughs> some sort of a wrestling or UFC, uh, you know, arena, because uh, they were fired up. Uh, they were. And so it was just so fun, and uh, we are just kind of getting warmed up with all this stuff. So make sure you stay tuned uh, with TV5, because next week we shot so much stuff. We had three cameras we at did. this thing. We interviewed more people. Uh, we're going to talk with more about uh, Heidi and her journey in education, and hear from some other people at the school about what they say makes her such a standout educator. Absolutely, and we get to talk to the teacher there who actually nominated her, so we're yeah. going to dive deep into that, and that's just so exciting. We plan to make this a regular thing, so you're going to have to stay tuned because we'll announce when you can start sending in those next round of nominations. We'd also say if you nominated somebody last time because the process of narrowing this down was so it difficult. Was so hard. I mean, it's just the stories that we poured through, uh, just nominate whoever it is you nominated again. Yeah. Uh, you know, if you were a nominee, nominate a friend. Oh, goodness, uh, I mean, to yeah. have a pile of people who make an impact yeah. in the community and with the kids, you know, that's just, it's incredible. I don't know Amazing. what I expected doing this the first time out. Right. Just over the moon with yeah. how it all went off. So Absolutely. we'll be coming again uh, in the fall. So make sure you stay tuned here.